Britain, we discard a million tonnes of clothes every year and replace those with two million tonnes of new clothing, an equation that means we're not just running out of space, but also time. 50% of what we cast aside ends up in landfill. These cheaply made, environmentally unfriendly plastic clothes are part of an epidemic, a cycle of consumer behaviour in which short-term satisfaction has become a threat to our long-term survival. Blimey, look how many countries they're selling it in. That is bonkers. In our shops, wardrobes and landfill. Made in Cambodia, made in Vietnam. We've been trained to think that paying more is a rip-off. People are calling this epidemic fast fashion. It's crazy. I mean, it's like a gorge. Nothing can prepare you for the smell of stench. But if we act now and start to think for ourselves, then the solution might be close at hand. Oh, blimey. Oh, yeah. Fashion Revolution was a result of the outrage that was generated after the very predictable Rana Plaza disaster. We believe in an industry that values creativity, profit and individuals in the same measure. We believe that the consumer is ready to ask questions of the brands and we believe that transparency is the new must-have in the fashion industry. So we're asking people to turn their clothing inside out on the 24th of April. Be curious, find out, do something about it and be part of this big change. I think we are looking at a new generation that is curious about the origins of clothing and curious about real luxury. I think we will look at the proverbial drop of blood on the hemline as the true luxury because it will signify that it was a person behind the thing that we're wearing.